Yeah, what was the feeling? I mean, did you guys feel as though you had a one? What happened? That hang on yeah. their pressure defense there when they're down the stretch at the end. What happened? Well, I think they made a, a great comeback in the second half, uh, especially thanks to uh, Parks. They had a great second half, and then uh, their one-three-one press. We did. We didn't really play against team that plays that kind of defense. So, and I think Parks uh, was the first man in press. Did a great job. He, he, he forced a couple of turnovers, especially me, and that's what I think uh, killed us. Is there difficulty? You guys had it up to like double digit 9, 10, 11 for a long time. So you just couldn't quite press it, get it, you know, over the hump for it anymore with any problem. Um, yeah, I mean, teams going along. They went on the run, uh, second half. And like Mondo said, that was pretty aggressive in that one to run. We haven't seen that since probably Green Bay. <laughs> and they had a long defender up top for the box, making it hard for Mondo and Dave Mondo, whoever they was up top, to get the ball across. Um, to anybody on the floor, so they did a good job of running that run, but uh, like I said, we, we won, so that's all that matters. Really Sheldon, are you, happy, are you happy, satisfied with how the team played, or do you feel like you kind of escaped this one? Um, kind of both, I would say. Like I said, I'm glad we won, that's all that matters, but we definitely have to be prepared for you know, unknown defenses that team throw at us, uh, be on the attack more, including myself. That's about it. Through the way you guys, um, when was the last time you played a game at 11 a.m.? I think AAU. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Mike? Back in Belgium. Back in Belgium. <laughs> you think it's going to be tough to get up for it? No, nah, we don't. I know we know it's early, but we won't be ready. So. Sheldon, the end of game execution by you guys. There's a bunch of different guys under the line, you included. I think you guys are 24, 26, or 23, or 25, something like that. How much do you guys pride yourself on just being able, even, you know, I'm sure you didn't want to let the 14 point lead slip away. How much do you guys pride yourself on just being able to close out in those tight moments? Um, different guys having the confidence to step up there and make free throws. Well, first, you want the ball, you know, you got to make yourself available. And uh, that's what, you know, me, myself, I mean, myself, Mondo, and Devon did. And we finished our free throws, so we work on in pregame. So um, that's still the game for the free throws. Talk about the three point shooting in the second half when you came out and hit your first four threes. Uh, I think Mondo's just been aggressive. You know, he was getting in the gaps. You know, he was kicking out. There wasn't even a one through one then. Uh, I think that's, that, that's what made him switch to the one through one. He was uh, getting in the lane and attacking and dishing out. So we had a good rhythm going and I kind of stopped it with the one through one. But we did a good job of attacking in the first half. Um, particularly, did you notice any difference with the 30 second clock? Second clock? Um, they, coach told us uh, before the game, but I mean, I didn't feel a big difference. I don't think anybody felt a big difference. Thanks, guys. Well, coach,